and as they go away, racing, setting off at a fairly sturdy, sturdy gallop early on as well, with silk and roses leading them now towards the first fence, so, uh, so it will be on the outside in second, White Abbey and Amorgaria, over in third and fourth, and then Ellen Sheen in five early on. Sixth place goes to Jean Cobbler, being restrained towards the rear, and last of all is Kilbrick and Rose in the hands of Luke Lennon, and as they feel make their way back towards the home straight for the first time. Place number two coming up, and the grey, silk and roses, places on the inside of So It Will Be in the centre, out three deep then is Amor Gary in the light blue sleeves, just tucked in behind them is White Abbey, alongside Ellen Shee, those two right in the mid-division, Jim Cobbler towards the outside in red and yellow, and then the white and red of Kildrick and Rose last, but very well group field jumping that fence right in front of us. White Abbey was a bit slow, but didn't make any sort of mistake as they go past us for the first time. And so three in the line, Silk and Roses, Tom Hamilton on the outside of Sue will be in form of Cornet, Joanne Hamilton. And Andrew Carrier. <coughs> as they get over the next, which are almost safely, Kilbrick and Rose jump in last of all, as they race on to the fence just going away from us. And this one is the fifth now. And safely over so it will be. Landed just in front there on the outside of Silk and Roses. White Abbey through on the inside, the outside of the field. Racing with Amor Daria, Joanna Walton, Ellen Shee, Jim Cobbler. Two lengths away to kill Rick and Rose as they jump the ditch. Rather rich for that was White Abbey there. Just lost the position as well to the Jim Cobbler on the outside of the field. Weave their way over towards the back straight. Amor Daria, who has twice uh, finished second in this meeting in the past, once in 2009, but also uh, last year when he was second in his corresponding race. He gives the lead with silk and roses, the grey on the inside. Of course, he was fifth last weekend, just a week ago. Then in third, he so it will be in the blue and white with a red cap. Over OK, White Abbey, another mistake for jumping any more and more sketchy as the race progresses for White Abbey and Gillen Crow. As they come towards another, Bill Richard Rose is the back marker. On safety over. And they now move on towards the ninth, which was their last, and which was their first last time round. And Silk and Roses and Pamela Downey will lead over. These two over together. From in third place, then, so it will be. Second, narrowly beaten at uh, Annick on the 26th of February, this horse, looking to go one better this afternoon, racing alongside there, Jim Cobbler, who was a winner last time out, and looks to give, as I said before, Victor Thompson and Christian Davidson a treble on the afternoon. There, followed through by Ellen Shee, Ellen Shee, who won the maiden race here a couple of years ago, will jump over next. Ahead of White Abbey, Phil Rick and Rose making a little bit of ground on the outside. And so they head up towards us with uh, just over a circuit to go in the Norrie Drummond Castle Bookmakers restricted race. And White Abbey again made a mistake at the rear. So, one lap left to cover, and it is Silk and Roses, who've been prominent throughout, who leads by three quarters of the race, Amor Downey in the centre. Here's Jim Cobbler pulling his way through on the outside to join. Silk and Roses at this one. Over then in fourth was So It Will Be. A chair of fifth place for Ellen Shin. Richard Smith on the inside of Kill Rick and Rose in the hands of Luke Lennon. And White Abbey at the rear. Over fence number 13. And all over safely once more. So they turn and go towards the ditch for the final time. White Abbey becoming detached a little bit at the back of the field. As they come on then, Jim Cobbler has taken over, the favourite leading down towards the next fence by two lengths of Silk and Roses in second. Over in third then Amor Daria, they were followed over in fourth by Stoic Will Be. Ellen Sheen Flick just squeezed along, as to is Kilbrick and Rose in sixth place, and White Abbey in seventh and last of all as they race off to the far side. And so with time to jump in the restricted race, Jim Cobbler. 
the odds on favour have a three length road here over Silk and Roses in second. So it will be making a little bit of progress now going third on the outside of Amoyalia. LHC just picking on to them. And then a gap for White Abbey and Gilbrick and Rose after next. And over that one it was still Jim Cobbler who made. Jim Cobbler, still Cooper is just hanging on to the leader. So it will be third, just squeeze for the first time. Amor Daria trying to go one better than last year's over in fourth. Ellen Sheet five, then Kilbrick and Rose, and then White Abbey as they go to the third last. And so Jim Cobbler comes to it by a length. Jim Cobbler over Silk and Roses on the inside, so it will be jumping in third, over in fourth Amor Daria, then Ellen Shee, Kilbrick and Rose jumps in at the back of the field with White Abbey as they turn back towards the home straight and the leader still, Jim Cobbler just pouring it on, lead by two lengths, Silk and Roses tying very hard in second place, flat out in third is so it will be, then in fourth is Amor Daria and Ellen Shee five, but none of them really making any inroads to Jim Cobbler, who's safely over the second last. He comes towards the final, French Tristan Davidson, Silk and Roses on the far side, Amor Daria, then so it will be. Here's the last fence then for Jim Cobbler, only narrowly over, shaken up because Silk and Roses putting in a spirited effort on the far side, and he's getting back up to the Silk and Roses. Oh, it's coming home, Jim Cobbler. Amor Daria was third, so it will be fourth. Over in fifth place will be Gilbert and Rose, then Ellen Sheen. Well, I'm not a good